Hey YouTube, it's ICU, and today brings great news for all of us who've been eagerly and patiently awaiting an iOS 6 and 6.1 untethered jailbreak for all iOS-based devices. And I've been flooded with new questions related to the jailbreak, and hopefully I'll be able to answer most of those in this video. Also, before we begin, I just wanted to say that I will discuss the giveaway I'm currently holding toward the end of this video, so just be sure to stick around for that. All right, and to start off, I'm going to open Safari and reference a few articles on my site. So first, today, Apple actually released iOS 6.1 to the public. Now this, of course, is following Saturday's release of iOS 6.1 Beta 5. The new iOS update includes LTE support for more carriers, additional Siri functionality that allows ticket purchases via Fandango, the ability to individually download songs through iTunes Match, and a new button that can reset the advertising identifier. And of course, with the new release, I did make a jailbreak tutorial for the iPhone 4, iPhone 3GS, and the fourth generation iPod Touch. Now this obviously was made possible through Red Snow with its Lime Rain exploit, which as I've stated before, is a boot ROM based exploit that functions on those devices and will continue to function on those devices as long as Apple supports them in iOS. So this is indeed a tethered jailbreak. However, you can use the semi-tether package from Cydia to convert it into a semi-tethered or a semi-untethered jailbreak, which means you'll be able to reboot it with limited device functionality. So just be sure to check out this tutorial and the corresponding video if you want to jailbreak your older iPhone or iPod touch on 6.1 without waiting for the untethered jailbreak to be released. Now onto the real exciting news for today. Muscle Nerd, the unofficial leader of the iPhone dev team and one of the four evaders, has tweeted a wealth of awesome information pertaining to the untethered jailbreak. Now as I'm sure most of you know, last week it was revealed that Muscle Nerd, Planet Being, Pod2G, and Pimskex formed a new team dubbed the Evaders to finish development of an untethered iOS 6 and up jailbreak. And until today, we were told by various influential members of the jailbreaking world that an untethered jailbreak would be released sometime after Apple issued 6.1, which was a rather broad time frame. Thankfully today, in a series of tweets, Muscle Nerd has added much needed clarity to their release schedule. So first in a concise statement, Muscle Nerd stated that those following fake Evader Twitter accounts will miss out on the excitement this week. Now of course the two key words in that tweet are this week, suggesting that they will indeed release an untethered jailbreak. And additionally, in response to a follower who inquired about domain main names, MuscleNerd revealed that the team will launch their evaders.com site pretty soon. Later, MuscleNerd confirmed that the jailbreak will function on all iOS-based devices with 6.1 except the third generation Apple TV, which means you can safely upgrade to 6.1 right now if you haven't already, and I'll actually get more into depth on upgrading to the latest firmware in just a second. Now, since he stated the jailbreak will support all devices that can upgrade to 6.1, that means it will function on the iPhone 3GS, iPhone 4, iPhone 5, 4 fourth generation iPod Touch, fifth generation iPod Touch, the iPad 2, the third generation iPad, the fourth generation iPad, the iPad mini, and the second generation Apple TV. Now for those of you who will inevitably ask about a more specific release date, thankfully Muscle Nerds covered that too. In a clever tweet, he inquired whether his followers knew that the Super Bowl is Sunday, and he posed the question, what will you be doing? While also CCing or carbon copying the Evaders Twitter handle and Evaders.com. And in not so many words, Muscle Nerd unofficially confirmed that the untethered jailbreak for iOS 6.1 should be released this weekend on Sunday. Finally, as a word of caution, both Pimskax and Muscle Nerd urged users to upgrade to iOS 6.1 via iTunes instead of Apple's over-the-air update feature. The iTunes restore method, when the time comes, will ensure that all users can successfully jailbreak without encountering issues. Now, for those of you who did upgrade through Apple's over-the-air update feature, you may be able to jailbreak once they release a utility. However, if you don't want to run the risk of encountering issues, I suggest you restore to 6.1 inside of iTunes instead. Now that can be done very easily. All you have to do is make a backup. Once you've created that backup, simply download and restore to 6.1. And once you've upgraded to 6.1 through iTunes, you can then restore from your backup that you created. So today has brought beyond great news for everybody holding out on an iOS 6 untethered jailbreak for all iOS based devices. And I will keep you guys completely updated on the jailbreak here on my YouTube channel as well as best tech info. And I will create a tutorial as soon as the utility is available. Now, really quick to discuss the giveaway. In the last episode of best tech info and rumors, I said that the giveaway would conclude that weekend. Now I'm actually extending it and I'm adding something to it. Whereas before it was only one $200 Amazon gift card. Now you have the chance to possibly win one of two Amazon $200 gift cards. So to enter to win, all you have to do is rate this video or any of my new videos 
videos up and leave a comment down below in the comment section. It doesn't matter what your comment is, as long as it's a relevant comment, it will automatically be counted and you will be eligible to win. And don't forget, that means you have an extra opportunity to enter to win on my iPhone 4, iPhone 3 Jazz, and fourth generation iPod Touch iOS 6.1 jailbreak video. So if you haven't already, just be sure to watch that video, rate it up, and leave a comment in the comment section. I'll leave an annotation to that video on the screen here if you're on the desktop version of YouTube, and I'll have a link to it down below in the more info as well. And of course, to be quickly updated on anything related to the jailbreak, just be sure to like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, and add me in one of your circles inside of Google+. And until next time, this is ICU, signing out.